first of all i can give to you what is meant by second order derivative second order derivatives why 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 is that order we can say dy by dx or else we can say y1 or we can say y dash or we can say f dash of x after first order derivative the y we can call it as dy by dx or y1 or y dash or f dash of x understand what i am saying to you second order derivative second order means we can spell dy by dx as d square y by dx square or y2 or y double dash or f double dash of x we can spell as d square by dx square or y2 or y double dash or f double dash of x third order derivative third order you don't have unfortunately but just listen because in uh, differential equations we'll discuss third order also that's why you need to remember third order we can call it as dq y by dx cube y3 y triple dash f triple dash of x these are the notations so every time in every question they won't ask uh, like uh, dy by dx or d square by dx they can use in different forms y2 y double dash okay y dash f dash of x f double dash of x all give same meaning that is very very important you need to understand dy by dx y1 y dash f dash of x all four give the same meaning similarly d square by dx square y2 y double y double dash f double dash of x give same meaning dq by dx cube y3 y triple dash f triple dash x give same meaning understand that line represent the same meaning for that i hope everybody understood now we can start the problems copy this first copy this copy this one question we'll discuss find the second order derivative of the functions given below okay the question they given like this like y is equal to x square plus 3x plus 2 differentiate with respect to x dear students after differentiate uh, y1 or y dash x square divided to 2x 3x divided to 3 2 divided to 0 again differentiate with respect to x y double dash 2x divided to 2 3 divided to 0 the final answer is 2 So after first derivative, the quadratic equation becomes linear. After second order derivative, linear differentiation become constant. So after differentiation means it's become diminishing. The the power is diminishing. That means quadratic to linear, linear to constant like that. Understand? I can move to the second question in this. Sir. Second question they given y is equal to x power twenty. We need to find second order derivatives. How to find second order derivative for y? Differentiate with respect to x. You can spell as dy by dx. X power twenty derivative twenty x power nineteen. Again, differentiate with respect to x. D square by dx square is equal to twenty into x power nineteen derivative nineteen x power eighteen. 20 into 19, 380 x power 18. Understand? 380 x power 18. And this is called a second order derivative, dear students. Are you following, everybody? Hey Manoj, 
If you move to another question like this, third one, y is equal to x log x, x cos x. So you can use uv formula, uv. This is u, this is v. dy by dx is equal to x into cos x divided to minus sin x plus cos x into x divided to 1 minus x sin x plus cos x. This is dy by dx. They said uh, second order derivative now. So again differentiate with respect to x dear students. It's not a difficult one, it's easy only. d square y by dx square is equal to, again this is uv, this is u, this is v, minus x into sin x divided to cos x plus sin x into minus x divided to minus 1 plus cos x divided to minus sin x minus x cos x minus sin x minus sin x minus 2 sin x. Understand? They may ask this question for two marks. I'm having trouble connecting to the internet. Take a look at the help section in your Alexa app. Minus x cos x minus 2 sin x. Understood? Correct? Everybody understood? Yes. Copy it. Can I move next question? Dear students, if class disconnected means you can come to YouTube live, okay? Okay, now? Nah? Okay, sir. Hmm. If disconnected means you can come there. Next question. Next question they given uh, log x, just log x. Y is equal to log x. Question number 4, y is equal to log x. Very simple, differentiate with respect to x, y1. Log x to 1 by x. Again, differentiate with respect to x, y2, 1 by x square to minus 1 by x square. That's it. Answer over. Very simple. Understand? Log x square to 1 by x. 1 by x square to minus 1 by x square. That's it. Answer over. Are you clear what I am explaining? Everybody? Yes, sir. Next one. x cube log x. Very interesting question y is equal to x cube log x. Question number 5. y is equal to x cube log x. It is like uv formula, no? uv formula. Differentiate with respect to x, y dash is equal to, this is u, this is v x cube into log x divided to 1 by x plus log x into x cube divided to 3x square. Now, x in x cube 2 times x square plus 3x square log x. This is y1. Again, differentiate with respect to x. y2 is equal to x square divided to 2x plus 3 into, again, this is uv. This is u, this is v. x square into log x 1 by x plus log x into x square divided to 2x. 2x plus x here I one time cancel. 3 into x, 3x. 3 to are 6x log x. 2x plus 3x, 5x plus 6x log x. This is y2. It's not a difficult one, but the steps are more. Two times you need to differentiate. In the first time also it is uv formula. In the second time also, this is u, this is v formula. Wherever uv came, I just underlined and I wrote uv. Here I wrote uv. Then you can understand clearly the steps. I hope everybody understood this question. Copy it. Copy it, everybody. Yes, copy it.
copy it. Once you came there, you can just message me in the chat box, okay? Then I can understand you people came. Next question. Next question they're given e power x sin 5x. E power x sin 5x. Question number 6 e power x sin 5x. U is e power x, V is sin 5x. This is U, this is V. dy by differentiate with respect to x. dy by dx is equal to The application of it release monos still it takes some time Nessa can Tanushi Patel. Hi Nessa. Hi Sanjana. Sanjana, you can. Shall we continue? Yes. Nira? Yes. After dy by dx, uh, this is u, this is v. e power x into sin 5x cos 5x into 5x raised to 5 plus sin 5x into e power x means e power x. Now take e power x as common. 5 cos 5x plus sin 5x. This is d over dx. Again differentiate. Differentiate with respect to x. d square by dx square is equal to this is u, this complete is v. Okay, good Sanjana. e power x into 5 into cos 5x minus sin 5x into 5x raised to 5 plus sin 5x cos 5x into 5 plus this is v now. This completely is u, this completely is v. v into what is v? 5 cos 5x plus sin 5x into e power x raised to e power x. Overall, take e power x as common. Minus 5 sin 5, 5 5s are 25. Minus 25 sin 5x plus 5 cos 5x plus 5 cos 5x plus sin 5x. e power x into 5 cos plus 5 cos. 10 cos 5x minus 25 plus 1 minus 24 sin 5x. This is the answer. They may ask this question for two marks. There is no doubt. I repeat once again. It's not big one, but steps are more. This is u. This is v. U e power x into sin 5x cos 5x. 5x raised to 5. Chain rule. Plus sin 5x into e power x raised to e power x. Overall take e power x common. 5 cos 5x plus sin 5x. Now this is u. This complete is v. 
u into this derivative 5 into cos 5x minus sin 5x 5x derivative to 5 plus cos 5x into 5 plus sin 5x derivative to cos 5x into 5x derivative to 5 plus this complete is v into e power x derivative to e power x take e power x common 5 5 is that minus 25 sin 5x 5 cos 5x 5 cos 5x sin 5x 5 cos 5 cos 10 cos 5x minus 25 plus 1 minus 24 answer over any doubt anybody That's it, second order derivatives. So, so I, uh, around uh, six to seven questions we discussed. Uh, just to practice these questions, so uh, you can understand second order derivative. Dear students, tomorrow we'll start uh, integration chapter. So, come to the live. Can you repeat again? Okay. This is u, this is v. u means e power x into sin 5x cos 5x, 5x raised to 5 plus v sin 5x into e power x, e power x. Total e power x common. 5 cos 5x plus sin 5x. Now again differentiate. This is u, this is v. u into 5 into cos 5x minus sin 5x, 5x raised to 5 plus sin 5x cos 5x, 5x raised to 5 plus v as t is term. e power x, e power x. Take from both terms e power x common. 5 5s are minus 25 sin 5x, 5 cos 5x, 5 cos 5x, sin 5x. 5 plus 5, 10 cos 5x, minus 25 plus 1, minus 24 sin 5x. Understand? You know, you asked, uh, repeat, uh, so I repeated. Understand? Good. I can stop the class now. So, second hand derivative, I hope you people understood. So, tomorrow we'll start with the integration chapter. Integration is very, very important. So many students are waiting for integration chapter, okay? That's it, today's class. Shall we move? See you all of you. Bye-bye. Have a nice day. Good night. So can Nira, Sanjana, shall we? Still three problems are left, huh? Shall we discuss those three also? I am ready. Okay, we'll discuss till time is there, no problem. E power 6x into cos 3x, next one. e power 6x into cos 3x. We'll discuss. y is equal to e power 6x into cos 3x. Correct? Yes, exactly. Same, y dash is equal to, this is u, this is v e power 6x into cos 3x derivative to minus sin 3x into 3x derivative to 3 plus cos 3x into e power 6x e power 6x into 6 chain rule okay that is equal to take e power 6 as common dear students minus 3 sin 3x plus 6 cos 3x i repeat once again everybody this is u, this is v. e power 6x into cos 3x minus sin 3x. 3x divided to 3 plus cos 3x into e power 6x, e power 6x, 6x divided to 6. From whole take e power 6x common. Minus 3 sin 3x plus 6 cos 3x. Again differentiate with respect to x. 
y2 this is u this complete is v okay e power 6x into minus 3 into sin 3x cos 3x into 3x raised to 3 plus 6 into cos 3x minus sin 3x into 3x raised to 3 bracket close plus v what is v minus 3 sin 3x plus 6 cos 3x into e power 6x e power 6x into 6 from overall take e power 6x common 3 3s are minus 9 cos 3x same like previous problem only minus 6 3s are 18 sin 3x minus 3 6 are 18 sin 3x 6 6 are 36 cos 3x 6 I multiplied inside e power 6x last step 36 minus 9 anybody 27 cos 3x minus 18 18 36 sin 3x understand this is the answer so it like big one but the concept is same like previous question dear students first i use uv formula if you understood please use the like button then i can understand this is u this is v e power 6x into cos 3x minus sin 3x 3x raised to 3 cos 3x into e power 6x into 6x raised to 6 chain rule 3 sin 3x plus 6 cos 3x now this is u this is v u into this derivative i wrote here plus v into e power 6x raised to e power 6x into 6 overall e power 6x common 3 3 is a 9 6 3 is a 18 3 6 are 18 6 6 are 36 understand copy it copy it everybody Can I move next question? Everybody? What is the next one they given? Uh, tan inverse x. Just tan inverse x. Y is equal to tan inverse x. Differentiate with respect to x y dash tan of 6 raised to 1 by 1 plus x square again differentiate with respect to x y double dash 1 by x raised to minus 1 by x square but this is not a x for this derivative 1 derivative to 0 x square to 2x so minus 2x by 1 plus x square whole square this is the answer once again tan of 6 raised to 1 by 1 plus x square 1 by x raised to minus 1 by x square. This is not x. 1 derivative to 0, x square derivative to 2x. So minus 2x by 1 plus x square whole square. I hope everybody understood what I am saying. Yes or no? I'll move to the next question. Question number 9. Log of log x. log of log x question number 9 y is equal to log of log x differentiate with respect to x y1 log x 1 by log x into log x to 1 by x chain root y1 is equal to 1 by x log x again differentiate with respect to x dear students y2 second order derivative it is look like 1 by x minus 1 by x square but that is not x. Again, you can do derivative of x log x. Minus 1 by x log x whole square into. Again, this is u, this is v, uv formula. x into log x to 1 by x plus 
log x into x square into 1. You may expect this question 100% in the final examination. Don't leave this question dear students. You can expect 100% this question. xx cancel. Minus of 1 plus log x by x log x whole square. Look like very simple but you can expect 100% in the examination. I repeat once again. Log x 1 by x. This is not x. Again log x 1 by x. 1 by x log x. Again derivative y2. It is look like 1 by x minus 1 by x square. This is not x. What is this? x log x. For that again do derivative. Chain rule. 1 by x minus 1 by x square. This is not x. So again do derivative of this. uv x into log x 1 by x plus log x into x derivative to 1. x x cancel 1 plus log x by x log x whole square. Understand? Everybody. Copy it. Copy it everybody. Good. Hi Azim, how are you? My older students. <laughs> Like they came. The last question the exercise sine of log x. Can I? Can I go to the last question, everybody? Sine of log x. Question number 10. Y is equal to sine of log x. After differentiate with respect to x, y dash. Sine of log x means cos of log x into log 0 to 1 by x. Again, differentiate with respect to x, y double dash. It is looking like u by v form, no? This is u, this is v, u by v. v x into cos of log x minus sine of log x into log x to 1 by x minus u cos of log x into x to 1 by v square means x square. xx cancel, take minus as common sin of log x plus cos of log x by x square. These are the questions are there in second order derivative today students. They will give compulsory one question in the examination. Don't leave. Each and every video, each and every class around the two marks to three marks you will get it. Okay. I hope everybody followed today class very nicely. Can I leave the class now? All the questions completed I think. Yes, in the second order derivative, 1 to 10 questions. Sin of log x, cos of log x, log x to 1 by x. Cos of log x by x, u by v form. v derivative x of u minus u derivative x of v by v square. x, x cancel, answer over. That's it, rest class. See you all of you, have a nice day. Good night, sweet dreams. Bye bye. Tomorrow, integration. Don't leave the class. Everybody attend. That's it today's class. See you all of you. Have a nice day. Bye bye.